the capabilities for virtualization enhancement. It also includes special technology, again, aimed at this mission-critical RAS, CCC, secure and data-sensitive uh, segment of the marketplace. Cache-safe technology, also known as uh, Pelston, that identifies and corrects for uh, cache errors and automatically disables portions of the cache. The results of this uh, solution, incredibly impressive performance results. And in each of these performance comparisons, as we've looked at both ourselves as well as uh, uh, Spark and IBM Power in the industry, we've taken the best in class for each benchmark. So we've not picked any random solution to give the best comparison. We've picked for that benchmark the best published result from any of the competition. And the results are simply impressive. So you know, here we're comparing for a TPCH. 2.3x as we look at ourselves. The spec FP rate, 1.1x based on the SGI platform. In terms of uh, spec JBD, 1.6x, the best published result. And these are for the high end uh, systems. So this would be for 16, 32, or higher processor systems. So world records of SQL performance and TPCH, unquestioned leadership in database. Let's look at the mid range marketplace. This would be looking at four or eight processor systems. Again, best in class results. Spec FP rate 2.3x in terms of a spec in rate 1.1x. And we're very excited today that HP is publishing the best SQL result that has ever been published from TPCC, uh, 2.1x better than their platform, 61% higher than the best TPCC results ever published before in the four processor segment significantly exceeding the industry's best, exceeding our expectation, and resulting in an enormous value proposition for the customers and for the industry. So, raw performance is just fabulous with this product. But also, with that performance, we believe it enables entirely new categories of products as well. Much of the architecture I came in was to tackle, to deliver, to allow solutions against segments of the marketplace. Business analytic is a critical area for IT strategically today. And as you look at uh, the uh, uh, quote on the uh, slide here, this is the guy running the Microsoft's uh, Worldwide Licensing and Pricing Group. And he basically says, hey, what used to take me, right, uh, uh, what used to take uh, days to do, I now complete in minutes. And those kind of dramatic step functions of performance literally enable new classes of usage models. Montecito, right, highly parallel architecture, the epic architecture scales great with both data, compute uh, size as well. Those huge on die caches make enormous differences in the results of the platform. So it's performance, it's enabling new applications. It's also things like reliability. Reliability is a critical characteristic of mission critical computing. We've already talked about the cache safe technology briefly, but also as part of the Itanium system and microprocessor, includes a very robust machine check architecture to identify, correct, uh, and handle uh, uh, any errors that do occur. It includes the richest set of memory mirroring, memory hot swap technologies. Again, mission critical computing features and capabilities. Itanium is also designed very specifically to allow the most secure computing that has ever been done. Itanium includes a special set of characteristics as part of the microarchitecture to allow secure applications, banking, credit cards, these back end, you know, high uh, critical, uh, mission critical applications. And the results of things like memory compartmentalization, special aging capabilities. Uh, the high performance parallel instruction sets, again, specifically targeted at the highest security capabilities in the platform. Well, obviously, the you know, benchmark is to change uh, enterprise mission critical computing. We expect that now that Montecito is uh, shipping, that it will uh, uh, continue that trend, if not accelerate it. The other piece that I'd emphasize, Dean, is that we have the applications momentum, which to me is, you know, 8,000 plus applications, 8,200, this is a big deal. The thing that's really changed as we moved into you know, 2006 is, what, what do we show behind you now? We have eight OEM shipping. 
And while we had commitments before, you know, these are you know, the uh, eight big mainframe uh, companies minus the two that you know, we're all now in production with uh, mission critical uh, computing platforms. And then, of course, you know, the last piece is talking about end users. And now we've gone through that hard, painful maturation process of new architecture. Now end users are putting in deployment and saying, hey, this thing rocks. So we're pretty excited about that aspect of the, uh, of the, uh, uh, of the uh, overall maturity of the Antanian family. And ultimately, it's going to be you know, when the uh, mission-critical computing, uh, high-end computing and HPC and risk replacement, that's the only 